So we're looking at perimeter of the sector. How do we calculate the perimeter of the sector? So let's draw a sector first of all. Let's say we have a sector. And this is O. And this is A. And B, this is sector AOB. We have sector AOB. A O B A O B How do we calculate the perimeter of the sector? A O B So when we talk about perimeter of sector A O B, what are we looking at? We are looking at the length of the length of O A plus length of OB plus length of arc AB. Thus, length of OA plus length of OB and plus length arc AB. So in that case, we know that OA is the radius of the circle. This is the radius and this is also the radius of the circle. OA is equal to OB, which is equal to the radius of the circle. So we can say length perimeter of sector sector A O B is simply equal to arrow plus arrow. This arrow is length of O A and this other arrow is the length of O B plus the length of the arc A B. This is L A B to indicate that L subscript A B. So which gives us two arrow plus what's the length of an arc? Theta over three sixty times two pi arrow. So this is the formula for the perimeter of a sector. So let's write it out boldly. Perimeter of sector AOB is equal to two arrow plus theta by 360 times 2 pi arrow where we know arrow as the radius of a circle so this is the formula for the perimeter of a sector so in our subsequent video we'll see how we can apply this formula for the perimeter of sector AOB